Welcome to Crafty Workshop Builds. This is part two of me upgrading the clutch on my Mark 6 GTI, so stay tuned. In part one, I showed how to remove the transmission, and now I'm going to show how to remove the old clutch kit and install the new one. I'll start by removing the pressure plate and the clutch disc. Now I'm going to remove the flywheel and the rear main seal. This rear main seal had failed, which caused an oil leak. I'm going to clean and prep the area for the new seal.
This is the new upgraded rear main seal that I'll be installing. This seal will need to be pressed into this aluminum plate before it can be installed. This is the RTV that I'll be using. Now I'm going to install the new lightweight flywheel. All the parts and tools that I've used for this clutch upgrade, I will have them listed in the description below. I will also have the torque specs listed as well. I'm going to rest this pry bar on the floor. I will also put it into one of the teeth slot. This will prevent the flywheel from moving while I tighten and torque the bolts to specs.
this is the clutch and pressure plate that I'll be installing. I use the clutch alignment tool to keep the clutch in place while I tighten the bolt on the pressure plate. There is a lot of oil in the transmission bell housing due to the oil leak from the failed rear main seal. I'm going to clean out the oil then replace the throw out bearing.
And that's going to be it for this clutch upgrade project. Let me know in the comment section below if you have any questions. And thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.